Does a chicken have a pecker? About a week ago, Adam called another child a pecker. And since then, all the children have been saying it. Packers running fine. Back and forth, the oil tank is full. But that's not what today's video is about. Today's video, we're going to go into becoming a mage, getting a spell book. I got to do some crazy exploring. And I think if I get to this guy, time in a bottle with the novice spell book, we can get some kind of glyphs or something. I don't even know what they're called. <laughs> what are they called? Yeah, these things. And I'm pretty sure you can make one that'll help you fly. I think. You guys are going to tell me what it's called because I don't know what any of this stuff means. To make the tier one book, we need to crush it out, guys. The source gems and a book. Pretty simple. Then it gets a little bit more complicated. Just a wee bit. Can I have one of these, please? Thank you. Check me out. Tube is a mage. Yeah. Just like that. Boom. <laughs> Now let's work on the time in the bottle catastrophe. And it's a catastrophe because this recipe, we have to combine it with our novice spell book that we just made. And we need a time in the bottle. But not only do we need a time in the bottle, we can't touch the time in the bottle because as soon as you touch it, you ruin the MBT data. So we have to sneaky peeky this into something and craft it. And hopefully it works. Let's try. To make the time in a the bottle, there's some steps you got to take. It's kind of a rabbit hole. I had to go to the nether, find the race, kill a bunch of them, get these soul beads, right? And then you can stamp them, make this glass, and then you use this glass to make these empty veils. And I already have all this stuff set up. The other thing you got to do is you got to take these guys' souls, which you suck out of soul sand using the soul extractor. And you got to cook them, but you got to cook them on the haunting fire, turn them into a dark soul, and then you stamp them with this stuff. They become a corrupted pixie. You put them in a jar. And then you can put them on a drain. Drain them out. And you get this stuff. The Ariel Essence. Which I already have some in there. And I already have the bottle that we need. The empty veil. And you put this guy right here. Boom. And it fills it up. And we get the Ariel bottle. Hopefully that makes sense how I kind of broke that down. But... I wasn't filming any of this, and I already had this set up for uh, making the Eternal Stella deals. So let's get started on the time in the bottle thing. I think what I want to do is there's multiple, two different ways you can make this. This is kind of the uh, arduous way, and then we already have this guy set up, right? So let's do it in here, and then what I'm going to do is I'll set up an arm. He can grab this, put it into a crafter with the book, two crafters. And hopefully we end up with what we need, right? This guy. Where's it at? Archmage spell book? No, that's the hard, hard one. We're not going to get to that one today. Or maybe we will. This guy. We need this one. The mage's spell book. So Tube's not a mage yet. You know why? Because you need the book. All right. This area is a little FPS hoggy. So I have to apologize about my video quality. We're going to remove this guy for now. Take that off of there. And what I want to do is I want to put a depot down here. And then I don't have any create power close by. But I think we can kind of weasel our way through this whole deal, right? We're going to take mechanical crafters and put them right here. We're going to spin these deals. Boom, they're going to go that way. And they're going to feed that guy. Yes? 
And then let's do this. We'll put this on top of here. And just for cheeky sake, we'll go like this. We'll put this book in here. Uses. Yes, that's going to work. No, it doesn't show on here, but I, I think it'll work. I'm hoping it does at least. And then we need a funnel on this guy. These are probably laughing at my idiocracy right now. That's going to go there. <laughs> and then we go something like this. We take a mechanical arm and we're going to tell this arm, you're going to pick up from here and you're going to put in there. Yes? No problem. Okay, that's golden. But now we need to power these two, right? So let's do this. Thanks to Quest Rewards, you get a bunch of these. <laughs> so we're going to use these dudes right here. We're going to take one. We're going to put you right there. He's going to run the crafters, right? That's enough juice. Perfect. And now we need to do something a little goofy here. We go like this. Boom. Put a shaft on here. Boom. And then a gearbox. There goes Pecker. I should probably turn him off, huh? Because he's just going back and forth right now, doing absolutely nothing. Nailed that. Ah, right there. And then this guy, he going to go right there. Yes? Enough power? You're happy? Okay, it's time to sleepy. Sleepy. I just said sleepy. All right, let's get back to this. Now, if we look at this recipe, boom, boom, RL bottle goes in the middle deal, right? And then arcane crystal, crystal fragment, two arcane gold nuggets. Should be easy, right? Is it going to work, though? That's the question. One of you go there. One of you go there. This and this. Boom. And then it said it needs 2,000 source. Which these are all full. We should have plenty of source. And then this guy goes in here. We're making the thing. And I'm missing the shot because I'm getting prepped for the ultimate mage book. Are you going to work? You better. Yeah. Grab that. Nice and fast. Yep, yep, yep. Just like that. <laughs> Put it in there. Yep. 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 Craft. Make tuba mage. The fact that we're using squirrel power for this, I think, makes it even better. R -r 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 -r. We got the mage spell book, baby. Now, what are these things called? I got to look through this. Maybe even look through a wiki. Because I want the thing that launches you <laughs> through the air. And I've seen Darkfan using one. That has an elytra deal. But he said he found that in a dungeon. I don't think we can craft that one just yet. Because I haven't been to the end. Let me do a little bit of research. And see what we want to play with. I got a better idea. Because there's people that watch my videos that love this mod. And they know all the cool things that Toomp needs to try. I got the scribes table. I got the mage spell book. And I can go a step further and make it this guy, the Archmage Spellbook, if I need to. We just got to do this Wilden Tribute, which I have done in the past. And I can fight that dude, no problem. But I think what I want to do is leave it up to you guys. You guys tell me what spells or whatever these things are called, glyphs, tube, should get. And on that note... We end this video. Everybody enjoy your weekend. Happy Saturday. Tubes out fishing. Catching monster flounder today. So I'll answer your comments when I get back. Enjoy your weekend. Have fun. Peace.